So my name is Blakely Ellis. I'm the uh, executive director for the Coastal Conservation Association here in Alabama. We're here at the Claude Petit Mariculture Center, and in this room is the broodstock tanks, which is where the flounder, pompano, and redfish currently are swimming around in these tanks, and those are going to be the, the mamas and the daddies of the future fish that, that get released back into the, the waters off the coast of Alabama. Traditionally, we've, we've spent over probably three, four hundred thousand dollars maybe even half a million over the years on artificial reefs. The artificial reef system off Alabama is the world's, it's the world's largest artificial reef uh, habitat. Nobody comes close to the amount we have. They've been deploying them since the 60s, both inshore, off the beaches, and out in the Gulf. And this department was a big part of being a leader in that. On this site, you'll also see some giant concrete pipe that, that we, we had shipped over from Mobile. Forterra Pipe Company, they donated it to us, and. Uh, and we paid to have it shipped over and unloaded. And so we've got more habitat, even though we're in good shape, we'll still take more if it's a, a low hanging fruit. And that's what that scenario was. Again, my name is Blakely Ellis. I'm the executive director for CCA Alabama. If you'd like to get involved with our organization or have, have some questions or whatnot, you can find us on our website. at ccaalabama.org or the, all the social media sites, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram.